Ruth here, and this is my Crawford's Companion Hall, number 14. It looks like this. I did buy more, but uh, this came in a bundle, so technically I bought two things. <laughs> but since well, one bundle had more than, you know, so it looks like it's more than two things, so it's just got its own video. Because the next, the next haul, I did only buy two. I think it is only two things in that thing. But there'll be a very short haul next one. Um, anyway. This... Um, they didn't write the name of it on the thing. So it was just a... Was it? Creator Concertina Gatefold? Collection? I guess, maybe? Okay, so we'll do this first because it's a... Uh, Right here. Um, it's called Two Cupcake. So you make a cupcake. And this looks like this. Like a whole huge cupcake. And it's in a candle, cherry, bow, and a cupcake bottom. And this is, shows how you're supposed to make the card. So step one, and a 6.5 by 12 inch. Then score the cardstock at each of the measurements above. So 2 inch, 4 inch, 8 inch, and 10 inch. You fold it to burnish it. Creators consuming gatefold card blank is shown. Hurt the notches on the outer die. And this one is these bits. To position and temporarily secure it onto the closed card blank, run this through your die cutting machine to cut the shape the shaped constituting gatefold card blank. Use accordion dies to decorate your card. When using the dies to decorate the front panels of the card blank, you may need to cut the die. You need to, di yeah. you need to die cut the shapes and cut them in half to fit each panel. Hmm. So these two come with the instructions. So glad about that. So let's put this back in. Oh, the reason why I was already open because I'm, I was, show I was uh, showing the mom my my purchase. She gets she gets like a space when I tell her when I start off the sentence saying it is you know there's another sale. <laughs> there's no one that bought something. So anyway, so this is the, the cupcake. This is the present, which is basically the same thing. But it's the present box instead. I have bought this for the owl, to be honest. The owl and the butterfly and this one. I'm not too bothered about those two, but still. Isn't that so cute? Look at this now. So cute. Um, sorry, I was yawning. <clears throat> and then, well it is night time technically, so. These two. It's a very beautiful butterfly. And a star. I guess that's the inside die cut, maybe? I'll have to look. There's seven pieces, so it could be the other one, this one, and two of these. You know what? I'm curious. Just say three on here. Give us the outside the main detail maybe. And I don't know. Oh there's twelve on this one, so it'd be like the eyes. Three eye circle overly shapes, beak, foot, the wing, and the whole thing. I do I'm curious now, so I'm gonna open it and show you. 
and show myself what in the world. What in the world? Why does it need seven dice? <laughs> well, the other one has twelve, so. This does not want to open, let me tell you. It is really annoying when it doesn't want to open. It's annoying when the stupid paper doesn't want to get off my finger either. You know what? I'm going to be fast and do it with some scissors. Because this is ridiculous. Okay. In the same directions, by the looks of it. Yep. Ooh. It's... Where did the banner come from? Hmm. So this is the. Ah, the cut in one. We cut out one, two star ships, shooting star, and a banner. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Now that makes me doubly curious on what in the world twelve of those ones are. It does two feet instead of one. Hmm. And it's got a uh, kind of. I have no idea what that is, but like that's been, that that shape reminds me of like that. What was that children's toy brand? Um, Fisher Price or something? That reminds me of that. I'm not really, I don't know. It's got the beak. Oh, it's taking two feet, two wings. The eye, bit, the other two eye bits. Huh. I guess you can use this like on, on the bottom where, where the guy's standing. I have no clue what that's for, but like, that could be used for other things too. Like, cause like, that's also a shape where you see on like on the end of uh, when you like, when you know, like stores got this cloth cover of some kind and like, these are like on the bottom. Anyway, <laughs> that's cool. So let's put this back in here. Somehow. Come on. Okay. I'm curious what's in here now too. Should I just open all of them? I'll open all of them. I need to open them all of them anyway because I'm, when I'm going to put them away, I need to open them all. Anyway, so. You know, I was about to say this present one was opening nicely, but uh, then it suddenly see, it starts opening nicely, but then it suddenly just doesn't. Which is really annoying. Throw that one over. Anyway. Finally. So what's in here? got tags. It's got tags. I guess I should have saw that. <laughs> For you, two shaped tags here. Like the, uh, you know, the thing here. And then there's a rectangle for that. And then, obviously the uh, full thing. And, um, what in the world is that supposed to say? Is it supposed to say anything? Surprise, maybe? Sure. I'm guessing it's surprise. I can't read backwards. But I'm guessing it says surprise. 
I was surprised because I wasn't expecting that. Because it's not on the front, you know? That's cool. Uh, it's nice when they come with guys you have no clue they were coming with. Okay, so that's in there. And let's see. We're opening this one. So, so the other one. And as you can probably tell, that is. Uh, well, first of all, let me say how much this was because um, I normally say that and I completely didn't say at all for this one yet. So, can't really talk and think at the same time. <laughs> You'll be expecting too much. Aha! So, ooh, aha, yes. The body is separate. You got the outer. Yeah, three pieces. You got the separate body, you got the outer base card die, I guess. And the inside design of the wing. That's the sword. <laughs> Alright, that's cool. Cool, cool. And now for the last thing. Oh, I didn't actually say how much it was. Okay, it was 35 pounds. Oof. Okay, and the four alphabet letters were part of the, uh, um, what's that word? National Color Month? National Craft Month. <laughs> the, uh, <coughs> the, um, the code was and the word coloring, that's why I thought it was coloring, not craft. But here, 26 floral alphabet letters. It would be cool if they did floral alf uh, alphabet number. Floral number, you know, they wouldn't be alphabet numbers. <laughs> yeah. So I got these ones because the largest line, 2.9 by 1.5 inches, are, because these, ones are bigger than the mini dies that I have. And these ones will, you know, pop up in the card. And plus you can also pay for these the floral bits on the inside. Like what they did here. That's pretty. Yeah. So let's open this up. Ah, I just hit my hand on the tripod. That's like not a tripod, it's just like a desk clamp thing in the box. But this one Oh, that's nice. This one opened nicely. Doesn't happen often. This one was a forty-one pounds ninety-eight. Ooh, ouch. Here we have it. On both sides. Way to go to use your packaging. Okay. That's pretty. Of all the flowers, I think I believe are the same. But like, this would need big, a big card. Let's see. I cut some smaller, like A6. A5, A6, I think it's A6. Some A6 panels, you know, and that maybe we would love to fit on there if you do it this way. But not very many letters would fit on. You know? So you'd have to be more of a 5x7 five by seven card, I think, to fit. That's my guess. Or at least bigger than an A6 UK. Obviously, 
for some odd reason, US and UK sizes are completely different, which makes everything so much more confusing. But yes. Okay. So that was the floral alphabet letters. You couldn't pass them up, you know. Especially when it was on sale. Even though it was like a really recent release, it was on sale. Which is fantastic. So yes. That was kind of a long video. Mainly it was because of me trying to open these things. <laughs> but anyway, should be fun trying to open I don't know, make one of these cards. If I remember to record, I'll have that as a video, maybe. But as you know, I, uh, I tend to forget to record when, I'm, when I suddenly get into the feeling of making something. Like last time when I made Mom's Mother's Day and birthday card. I totally forgot to record. So I thought, you know, I was on like a different car. I was like, oh, well, get all the die cut and everything, and I'll record me putting everything together, and then, and then I just put everything together without recording anything. <laughs> so, if I remember to make a video, then it might be one of these. Or if you one of the other things. I mean, this is haul number 14. It could be anything from any previous hauls. And this one or a different brand. So, I'm just rambling now, so thank you for watching, and for now.